Alrighty. How's it going, everybody? My name is Milik, and welcome back to FNAF VHS Tape Reaction Videos by, uh... Who was it again? 12 Men OP. Now there's one more tape that I told you guys about yesterday, and this is the one right there. It's the Fastverse Collection 1, Afton Secrets. This is a very long tape. It's about 48 minutes and 40 seconds long. This might be the longest one so far, so this is the tape that I'm going to react today, so... Without further ado, here we go. Let's see what this is all about. I'm gonna get rid of this quick. There we go. Captain Emily Robotics, 1979. Circus Baby Pizza World presents the rebranding. Okay, uh, film editing William Afton, Howard's Film Lab, writing Henry Emily, speaker John Small. We can't be stopped. Oh. Hold up, did I see something back there? So, there's a text down there, but I can't really read it. Oh well. There's a kid inside that. Probably the bite victim. Oh no, that's not the bite victim. What am I? Who am I kidding? Jeez. Wow, this is so good! I like the animation! What? <laughs> Today on tr okay, that was fast. Soul Snatcher. Oh, this is gonna be creepy video. <laughs> I wanna watch it anyway. Okay, this is interesting. 
Nowhere to run, right? Man, this looks like real life footage. It's your fault. You let him in. <gasps> Bunny? Your pal. Your best buddy. Soul Snatcher. Tonight on True Point One. Oh, is this like a trailer? Sheesh, wow. Okay, that was like a trailer or something. I like the music, by the way. Okay, now what? We're interrupting this program to bring you breaking news provided by True Point One News Magazine. We're sorry for inconvenience. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. This is Judith Monday with True Point Magazine, and this is breaking news. A tragic series of events at a local I heard that before. restaurant, Fred Bear's Family Diner. One child is dead, and several have been injured. A horrible accident had occurred at a local family restaurant, Fred Bear's Family Diner, not only a few minutes ago on Brennan Street in Bellwood, Texas. Due to an extremely violent bully attack, employee neglect, and a poor rules execution, six-year-old Norman Afton, beloved son of William Afton, the restaurant owner, had lost his life. Norman? I thought it was Joseph. injured by animatronic mechanisms trying to get him out of the steel jaws. Our reporter, Mark Johnson, is currently at the scene. Thanks, Judith. A horrible incident. Mark Johnson. <laughs> it was horrible. Horrible. It... I'm so sorry for the owner. Today, a few minutes ago, a child had his fatal birthday party at a local family restaurant called Fred Bear's Family Diner. I arrived at the scene and I saw probably the most gruesome thing in my 13-year career. Thanks to the footage our unit managed to save, we were able to arrest the main suspects of that horrible incident. Suspects said there were Jeff Simmons, Ruben Green, Tom Harris, wearing the bear, rabbit, and bird masks. All what? were 11 years old. They have been arrested and the parents will be taken to the police department for questioning. The National State Court of Dallas will decide about the children's fate. However, one of them wearing a fox mask made out of the sea quickly enough to outsmart all witnesses here. Unfortunately, CCTV systems were unable to identify the fourth suspect, even after browsing previous recordings. If you happen to know who this fourth child is, please contact your local police department immediately. After robotic CEO, William Afton states that he is devastated by that tragic loss. He also pointed out that one janitor had disactivated safety systems in Fredbear, probably being involved with his son's murder. Such act has been proven later on CCTV footage. Said janitor have also been arrested. Are you taking me? I haven't done anything! Leave me alone! He's lying! I swear to you, I haven't done anything! You have the right to maintain silence. Somebody help me! Mr. Afton said that such act is unforgivable and stated that in court he will demand five million United States dollars compensation for his loss from suspects' families. Wow! Diner will keep its doors closed until further notice. I'm Mark Johnson, and this has been True Point News. Whoa! 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 Okay. Hello, Fred Bear. What? Did I saw? It? Oh, what the fuck? Why? Where's that? Too. 
Tell me this. Who will convince Elizabeth to take an ice cream from a circus baby? Just to make sure that thing works as intended. Okay, I get the point. I, I really don't think that stuff with Norman was necessary, though. Like, we could have played that a lot smoother, Dad. Henry started to see some irregularities. Like, are you trying to get us in trouble? Honestly. Well, after sacrificing Norman, I must admit, things went out of control a bit. No doubt on that. But it was necessary! And at least I predicted that some bad shit would happen, and managed to forge fewer security recorders a few nights before to somehow maintain your innocence and still be able to sue our helpers' families and janitor for nearly five million dollars with evidence I have personally forged! <sighs> Speaking of Henry... Well, I'll do with him, but not right now. It'll be too suspicious. The court will start seeing things. Okay, no point in arguing. What do you want from me, Dad? I've gotten quite wealthy recently. I've come up with an amazing idea to run a circus pizzeria once again, but for a greater scale. After the Bellwood abduction incident, the court ordered me and Henry to decommission phone time animatronics and store them in a safe and closed storage facility. I want you to bring them up here with my friend Joe's help. Joe? Did you mean that old creep that's guarding the bunker? Yes, come on! He's not a creep. You and Joe will take boxes with animatronics into the car and bring them to my garage. Later, I'll upgrade them. I launch a new set of restaurants across this whole region. This time, it will be more than 278. <laughs> I'm calling this the reactivation project. <laughs> That was decent. Wait a sec, I see some. Okay, wait. Oh, I missed it again. Hold on. I want to see that. Okay, stop right there. Oh, there was nothing. I thought it might be something, like saying something or whatever. Welcome, dear ex Afton Emily Robotics employees. This tape might not be just an ordinary video guide, but it is an undefeatable proof of our unstoppable progress. But since that there has been many rumors about our business, we've decided to make the statement to throw away any bad opinions about us. Firstly, we should explain the incident of the past weeks, commonly known as the bite of 80. We are terribly sorry for our beloved founder, William Afton's loss. This shouldn't have happened. Obviously, the real cause of this unpleasant situation were definitely poor rule execution and disobedience over fundamental safety regulations of some of our treacherous workers. They have been immediately discharged and arrested by local police units. Unfortunately, they have caused severe reputation damage of our business, so by the court's decree, we had to close Fred Bear's family diner, decommission and scrap currently used animatronics and temporarily close Afton Emily Robotics. Our founders have come to an amazing idea to team up again and form a new company, Fazbear Entertainment, as well as a new restaurant with four new That's FNAF 1, isn't it? With the technology based of Circus Baby's Pizza World's animatronics, but with much more safer technology thanks to our big budget of worth of $5 million from compensations gained from culprits' families at the court. This whole extremely difficult process has been called Reactivation Project. Main goals include 
acquiring old CBPW ASLE0 at models from ZBPW storage unit. Reprogramming and rebuilding ASLE0 models. Buying and rebuilding property to fit modern restaurant regulations. Assembling all things together. Taking profit from giving children entertainment they deserve. Improving scooping mechanism to kill even more innocent beings. 278 is too few. There is that entered? You may not remember me. But we used to be close. We played together a lot. Do you remember? Wait, is that Michael? Michael Afton? You know I had a beautiful life. I had everything what I wanted. I think that's Michael speaking. Loving family, mommy, daddy, and two brothers. No, that's not Michael. Who could that be? I did not know that life can be really bad. Then my dad went to Vietnam. Soldiers needed him. Once he came back, he has changed. My daddy started to act weird. I was worried. He only said, it's okay, honey. I'm fine. Do not worry. Go get some ice cream from the baby. Elizabeth? No, 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 that can't be. I beg for mercy. No one could hear me. Daddy was only laughing. That is why I'm here. Wait, Elizabeth? Whoa, 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 whoa. What the fuck is that face? Stop him at all costs. Wait, 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 wait. I need you. You can help me escape. What? <laughs> Help me, Michael! Oh my god! <coughs> oh! That scared me! Holy crap! What the? Hello? Hello? Joe! Oh, great, I'm glad he's still holding up there. Don't worry, ma'am. I got used to it. How's your day going? Good. It's... Yeah, it's calm. <coughs> I'm, uh, disposing of that waste now. <sighs> and now only a few bags left. Nice, nice. Are those out of a trunk still at the place? Yeah, safely packed inside the wooden crates. I'm happy to hear that, man. Listen, there's one thing I need to tell you. Yeah, what is it? Michael's coming in a few hours. Oh. I want you to provide him best care as possible. He'll stay there with you for a few days. Okay, but why, William? It's because of my new reactivation project, and I need those animatronics as soon as possible. Oh. I want you both to transport them safely to my garage. Okay, yeah, I see. No problem. Who's that? Vent pipes. Uh, probably just take the rust. Well, no need for worries. You're gonna leave that place soon with Michael, anyways. Yeah. You know, being a bunker reminds me of something. You mean those events about one burger shop for about a year ago? What the hell? Is that the big storage room? Nah, man. It's probably just a rat. I'm fine. Dude, check the camera! Jesus, okay, I'll check. What the fuck? Uh, weren't those boxes supposed to be lying there untouched? <sighs> Shit, Joe. That's what I feared the most. Better kill yourself immediately. Was, is there a burglar? I've, I've got a gun. I can deal with it. Joe, listen to me. You're not dealing with the burglar. What? No, no. Ghosts aren't real. It's impossible those things just breached out of those boxes. Right, William? Sure. William? 
William. What's wrong with you? Where are you, William? What the hell's going on? Tell me! Tell me this is not the animatronics! Do not after me! William, answer me! No! What time, Foxy? Holy Christ! <laughs> Whoa, 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 what the hell happened? I was quiet there for a minute. What the hell happened? Did he got killed? Oh, it's another footage. What the fuck? How many footages are there? Okay, so, I guess I'm getting closer. I've been circling around this place like a moron for quite a while, and I have no idea what I'm doing, honestly. <laughs> yeah, I have no idea what the hell you're doing. <laughs> you Son of a gun. Are you walking in the woods? Or driving a car? Wait, 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 what does that say? I, I, I want to read that, but I can't really read it. There. Oh well. I'm trying to figure out what I said, Dad. <laughs> I know you like these kind of riddles. Well, I couldn't read the fucking thing. Okay, uh, back to the main topic. Uh, I think I found the place and hoped it wasn't real so I could just go home. But, you know, life can be surprised. Whoa! I think that was a- I think that's a cum, Michael! Please. Okay, it looks a lot scarier, like, than on the picture of my dad showed. You're in there in the middle of the night, really? It's kind of like in the middle of the night right now. Yep, I totally guessed it. Oh my god. Why am I fucking tired? I don't know. Whoa! Is, did I see something in the darkness? I thought I see something. What? What was that? Never mind that. Let's go. First, I need to meet with Joe. But Joe's dead. Oh my. Well, I'm at the place and it kind of looks like the picture on the magazine. There's a lot of boxes, but no animatronics. That's, that's great. What's this? Is that like a train tunnel? For what? Okay, why would my dad need a train tunnel? I feel like I'm like looking at stuff I probably shouldn't be, but, uh, screw it, uh, I need to find Joe, um, maybe this door will lead to... Whoa! I thought it was like an animatronic eye. Okay, I have no idea where I am. Uh, there's water? Am I in a sewer right now? Is that what's happening? This... Alright, this place is... What the fuck? Oh, no, no, no. Okay, well, shit. Um, I think Joe just died. Uh, okay, maybe, maybe I'm just hearing things. Okay, this is starting to get sketchy now. Uh, I don't, I don't know. I think. Okay, I'm just gonna go through this door. Oh! Is, um, Sister location! 
Holy crap! Look how fucking real that looks! Probably dead. Oh my god. I'm freaking out. Um, I need sleep, like, now. I honestly don't give a shit. Um, if I'm sleeping on the floor, I, I need rest. Um, I feel like I'm losing my mind, and I'm starting to, like, lose grip uh, on reality, so... I'm gonna go to bed before I have a fucking mental breakdown, so, yeah. Signing out. What the fuck? Oh, there's a gang. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. I don't know if you can. I can hear you. Don't be a dumbass. I'm sorry. For what? Oh, it's the Fred Bear. You are broken. We're still your friends. Wait a minute. What? Do you still believe that? That's for FNAF 4, isn't it? I'm still here. I'll put you back together. I'm with you. We will help you. We will make you. Wait, what did I say? Wait, 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 wait. I want to. I want to read this. We will make you. We won't make him suffer! Oh, that's what it says, okay. I wanted to read that, so... <laughs> Dude, really? <laughs> you don't have to freak me out like that? What? Whoa, 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 dude, relax! What? You killed your own brother! Oh, I know this! Michael did this, right? <gasps> wait, 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 what did I say? What did I say? What did I say? Norman hates you! Oh, that's what it says! Oh my god! Oh! I don't know how much more I can take of this, but I'm, but I'm so close to the end, so I'm getting to the end of it. What was that? Who's that? Michael? Oh, Michael! Thank God. Okay, Michael's up. Okay. I have to find Joe right now. I can't stay down here any longer. I have to find Joe. I have to find Joe. I have to find Joe. I don't give a shit. If I have to look in every single fucking room, I'm gonna find Joe right now. I don't have food, I don't have water. I'm gonna starve here. If I don't find that creep, I'm gonna find Joe. Where the hell is my flashlight? Oh shit. Uh oh. Hey, 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 oh. hey, 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 Bitty Bat? Bitty Bat? <gasps> Foxy! Oh my god, Foxy, Foxy! What is he doing here? Wait, oh. uh, I thought you were supposed to be in the box. Stage? Whoa. No? I'm prepared for a jump scare. Oh, nothing. Okay. Oh! 
Ballora? What is Ballora doing here? I thought she was in the Ballora gallery. What the heck? This is weird. Oh, he made it. I thought, I thought he was going to get jump scared or something. Fucking music box. Shut up. Michael, chill! I'm not scared of you! And don't you think for a second I am! Cause I fucking crush you! Maybe in the office? Whoa! You piece of shit, work! And. Whoa, 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 whoa! What else about that Foxy? Whoa, oh my god! I found, I found Joe's room! I found his room! I won't die! I'm not gonna die! He's gonna help me! Okay. I'm just seeing things. It's not real. It's just my imagination. It's my imagination. Michael, it's just your imagination. No, it's not. Okay, no you did what you did, Michael. <laughs> my father, my dad, I don't want to be yeah, disrespectful, though. I'm gonna get help. I'm gonna get out of here, okay? Okay, Michael, just calm down. It better be this fucking door. Could be this door. What? 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 No! 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 Is that Joe? Joe! Was that Joe? Whoa! What the fuck is he? Is he? Is he in like the? Oh! Is he in the like the um the office building like the other? Rooms? Like this was where the these... Bed? No! 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 <laughs> no! No, Michael! You're not gonna die, Michael! You're not gonna die, Michael! Yeah, hi! Yeah. What the fuck do you mean? Of course you're gonna fucking die out! What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, and it's supposed to kill you! Now it's my turn! It's my turn, right? You traitor! fucking piece of shit! <laughs> I didn't know. My own son wants to kill me too, right? There's a hand! Fucking traitor! I hate you! Damn those fucking animatronics, man. I'm done. I'm done. You betrayed me, Dad. You betrayed the one person who ever had your fucking back. Just wait till I leave this place. I'm gonna tell the police. Do not! Don't I, Freddy? Uh oh! Uh -oh. Go, 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 go! Oh my god, run! Oh, it's locked! Oh, he's done! Michael's dead! Stop trying, Michael! What will you do? Call the police? It's over, they don't care about- Wait, 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 hold on, that was way too fast, hang on. They don't care about us. You know that. You will not redeem yourself that way. You help him kill me and Norman. That is a. That is a. Oh my god, hold on. That is a fact. Do not try denying that. What does that mean? 
If you want forgiveness... Nicely done, Michael. So he made the right decision? I forgive you. I love you. Wait, I'm guessing that's Charlie speaking. My guess, I mean. He loves you. What the? Puppet restroom woman? Ah, uh, okay. What's this all about? <laughs> What's this all about? Nothing happened. Ma Michael? Was that Michael? Why are you in the woman's bathroom, you idiot? Why are you in there? Dude, what the fuck is going on? Is that really Michael or William Acton? Probably Michael. Uh, what now? <laughs> what just happened? <gasps> what was that? Something just hit that person, whoever that is. Oh my god. It's Ennard! Hi, Ennard! Did you do that? Whoa! Hi! <laughs> what the hell, Ennard? We are free! Happy man, you made our lives miserable. We will find you eventually. Oh, dude, that breathing. You have no idea what enraged 278 lost souls are. Hey, hold on. 278 lost souls are capable of. We have taken away your son. Do you want to know what else can we do? Watch. All right, I'm watching. March 13th, 1984, Telegraph, Bellwood, Texas. <coughs> Martin, respond as soon as possible. Citizens have for some time started to report the occurrence of dismembered animals on local roads more and more frequently. All of them were dismembered according to a certain pattern. Limbs were removed, abdomen cavities were torn apart, brains removed, all of guts expect the hearts were also gone. We were searching this whole place. Missing organs nowhere to be found. You have no idea how dangerous is this kind of waste. At least local municipal institution undertook the action of cleaning the streets. Okay. April 11th, 1984, Telegraph, Bellwood, Texas. Martin, bad news. At the sheriff's office, local woodsmen had reported a significant worsening of a problem of dead animal bodies. Each of these bodies were dismembered in the same way as I've told you before. He also claimed that in nearby forest, at around 2 and 4 a.m., hundreds of screams can be heard. Those are horrifyingly too similar to human ones. Boss decided to mobilize the 12th police unit to search up the area and provide protection to our city's residents. April 12, 1984, Telegraph, Bellwood, Texas. Martin, I don't know what to do. They went missing. It's been 10 hours, still no response. What the hell is going on? Please respond. <gasps> Whoa! I saw that! What the hell is going on? Please respond. Well, hold on. Right! Oh! Damn, I keep missing that! I, I want to see what that is. Hang on. I want to try to read that. Whatever that was. Hang on. Re oh my god. I need to be... I need to time this right. Response. What the hell is going on? Please respond. Oh, I almost got it. Jeez, I want to read that. Hang on. 
Still no response. What the hell is going on? Please respond. Okay, got it. Uh, it's something about expensive items. Well, I'll read it later. You guys can tell me. I don't want to waste too much time. June 23rd, 1987, Telegraph Federal Bureau of Investigation. Washington, D.C. Case 373,222. 1984, Police Department of Bellwood, Texas reported recent incident involving vanishing of 12th unit. Standard measurements have been issued. Chopper engaged. Area secured. Heavy unit engaged. Result, 26 deceased. 0.5% survival rate. Chopper destroyed. 6,326,327 dollars loss. Plus one unit survived. Plus obtained critical information, photograph. Third party's involvement confirmed. Third party confirmed to be hostile. Third party confirmed to be non-human. Third party confirmed as an inorganic entity. Third party species type unknown. Extraordinary measurements have been issued. United States Marine Corps engaged. United States Air Force engaged. Standard measurements issued. Result, zero deceased. 100% survival rate. $12,211 loss. Third party nowhere to be found. Case 373,222. 1985 to 1989, standard patrol of the area issued. Bellwood, Texas. Rate, four times a year. Patrol 1 to 4, 1985. Result, none. Result, none. Result, found four dismembered animal bodies. None. Result, unusual sounds near abandoned bunker. None. Patrol 5 to 8, 1986. Result, none. Result, none. Result, none. Result, none. Patrol 9-12 colon 1987. Result, none. Result, found six dismembered animal bodies. Result, found one dismembered human body. Standard measurements issued. Result, none. Standard measurements disengaged. Patrol 13-20 colon 1988 slash 1989. Result, none. Result, none. Result, none. Result, none. Patrol 21-1990. Result, 26 deceased. 0% survival rate. All vehicles destroyed. $3,252,116 loss. Third party returned. Engaged U.S. Air Force 225th Interception Unit Fish Brain. Too much risk in sending another ground unit. What? I was listening to that. <laughs> oh, Bellwood. Is that from somewhere in Udat? I don't know. <clears throat> Nothing's happening, just a uh, normal looking place. Whoa! Oh, it's just a freaking Air Force, man. It just scared the hell out of me. <sighs> There's nothing wrong with it, though. Forest. Uh, hey! Forest Nation Park. Oh, okay. Up. So screw it. Let's do the damn fully armed Super Hornet. Damn Soviets! 
They're up with something. Probably the soldiers are creeping around here well hidden, but probably managed to sink deeply inside our territory undetected. I don't think it's Soviets. No one normal, not even them, are leading mangled and limbless corpses around the forest in town for no reason. Really? I didn't know that. Were you sleeping at the briefing? Fine, girl. Jesus, I'll do whatever the command says, but it still tickles me. Not the Soviets, then what? I have no idea. One survivor said that he saw a human-shaped thing charging at him. It was made entirely out of wires or something like that. You can tell he is still in shock. There's no such thing as evil electric cable monster or other wacky alien technology. Never mind. <laughs> Don't forget your primary objective, boy. Yeah. Just fly around and look for unusual heat signatures. Piece of cake. I'll share the intel to fish brain too, so I'll have to hang up for a while, baby. Yeah. Oh, and one more thing. Be sure to increase your oxygen pump power when you feel the urge. Its values have been lowered by the fall, since this is not an air-to-air -air combat mission. Whoa! Fishbrain 1 to AWACS. Power. Do you read? Ah! God, nothing! Damn it! Fishbrain 2, Lewis, do you read? What's up, number one? Got some intel? Here's our intel, dummy! We lost the contact to our AWACS. You've gotta be kidding me. I can literally see your plane in the distance. This is the new signal problem. What's going on? <sighs> Something must be interfering our signal. We're suffering from severe damage. Lock on this is really useless. We're dropping the air. Can you feel that you're alive, boy? Oh, God. Why is she losing altitude so rapidly? Shut the fucking mouth! We got a heat silhouette! Where? What? This is food and real? We need your guns! I've got a glimpse on it! It's crawling on a power tower! Damn it! What? Tracking is not working! I can't even. Fish brain 2! Fish brain 2! Crap! Uh oh! Looks like I am the last man standing here! Come in, you cunning bastard! I don't need missiles! I'll kill you with my gun! Enjoy our little display? Imagine what we can do with your dead, happy man. Start running. What? Whoa! Wait, 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 wait. What the fuck was that? Hang on a minute. I see something over. I see something. Hang on. There was something on the top left. I didn't quite catch that, but whatever it was. You guys can tell me. Whatever that was I saw in the... In the fucking... Oh! It's over! Wow, 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 wow. Man, I really wish I could voice act in one of these tapes, man. That could be really cool. Maybe I, maybe in the future, maybe I can do a voice acting. Maybe. I don't know. But that was... um, That was the Fazbear's Collection 1. Load of, oh, shut up. That was the uh, Fazbear's Collection 1 after the secret. I honestly... I honestly don't know what to say. Like, whew, Really, really caught my attention. Like, honestly, it was pretty good. I have to admit. Honestly, it's pretty cool. So, I've been thinking for a little while... Somebody commented me uh, on my videos uh, yesterday, I think. I think this guy called Noobzor9... And I've been thinking, 
Should I react to this guy videos? Hold on, let me see what he has. I want to see. So, what do you have? Hold on. Um, where's the video? Hang, 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 hang on, hang on. I'll find him in a minute. Hold on. Does he have also uh, cannon tapes? He has actually. There are. Oh, actually, there's a lot. We have season three, season. Where's season four? Hang on a minute. I I, I could have sworn I saw season four there. Ah, maybe it's just me. Oh, there's also bonus tapes. Might as well watch that. Okay. So, if you guys want me to react this, uh, this dude's, uh, tapes, let me know down in the comments below. That's it for the tape I react so far, but I have to admit, it was pretty good. It got me a few times, but, oh, man. So, that's it for now, folks. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If it did, be sure to drop a like, of course. Do not forget to subscribe to the channel if you guys are new to me, and I will see you dudes in the next video.